match of the year. So far in AW. Match of the mud? Match of the year in AW since 2021. 2021. This is the match of the year for AW. What match beat this? This was so good. And the story was there. The storytelling between these two for the last whatever months it was lived up to this match. And this was so good. Like, it, it was... I think their wrestling match from their other fight was better wrestling style, but this was the, the, the hardcore elements added. This was so good. This was so entertaining, if I can put it in that way. It was very, very entertaining. Brad said it was Janela versus Omega and Dark. Oh, oh yeah. now I remember. Yeah. This is what Brad's doing. That was called Unsanctioned? Really? Brad, yeah, Brad's the encyclopedia. He remembers everything. I forget things. I'm getting old. God, <laughs> I don't remember. I, I remember, like, watching that after, but... Huh. That was the first dynamite. Yeah, I was there. I don't remember that. But um, um yeah. Um I think it's match of the year so far. And probably it's I'm telling you, in my eyes, one of the it's up there, it can be in your top ten women's matches of the last decade. Like, if you're thinking about women like great women matches in these promotions from the last decade, this has got to be one of the best ones. Like I'm putting this up there with, with Bailey and, and Sasha from the first takeover in Brooklyn. Yeah. Yeah. Like this was so good. Was this was pay per view quality. It's so funny, right? Like how we every everybody like destroyed Britt Baker, right? And like look where she's at now. And she's gotten so much better being a heel, getting better in the ring. And then she's like having her best matches with Thunder Rosa. And Thunder Rosa is so Thunder safe Rosa. to work with. <laughs> like Thunder crap. Rosa. <laughs> Sorry. I already say Thunder Rosa and with Thunder Rosa. <laughs> I love that girl, Thunder Rosa. She oh, can Lord. wrestle all the time. Oh, she wrestles so good, Thunder Rosa. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Moving on. Yeah. Blood. 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 Thumbtacks. Blood. Do you ever see that? Do you remember that back in the day? That clip, that video clip of the the guy in a, the little brother and the and uh, the older brother, but they're like babies, and he was like bleeding, and the 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 mom's videotaping the kids like blood, blood. And mom's like where? Right to her, blood. Yeah. I'll send you that clip after. Yeah, it's so funny. It okay. But yeah, women with blood, both bladed, yeah. both had blade spots. I'm like, oh, good for them. This man. is new. I feel bad for like the thumbtacks, just like to pull those all oh. out. Like I cringe, man. Like she had so the, many. Oh was it one God. of the promotions I watched the other week? Uh, Akira had a whole bunch in his head. And they were like pulling it out. It was like the credits, so they were pulling all the fucking thumbtacks out of his head. Man, props to both ladies so, in this match. They took a hell of a beating in this oh match. God. Like Britt no. took most of the beating too. Like she got Death Valley drivered onto the ladder from the top rope. She got th uh, thunder. Uh, yeah. What's it called? The thunder driver or thunder whatever. Like the the last move of the match from the outside of the ring to the outside through the table. She went. Um, she went on to the tax. Like, man, Britt took the brunt. Yeah. Good for her. Work. It just showed, like, how much of a badass she is. Like, she's had the best matches with Rosa. Like, seriously. So, like, I think I, we speak for everybody now to, like, put the freaking belt on her already. Right? My God. Put it on her. But then but, we know this is building double or nothing. Her for sure. We're probably most likely yeah. going to get a title change. My, it my, my assumption. It should. But it's just, it's just making her stronger and better. Yeah. Which I, which I love. So such a good match. This was so no, like social was so split about this match. Split, really? Oh, oh my god! Like the stuff I was seeing, like hating on it, saying that women shouldn't be blading, that oh women shouldn't god. be wrestling. Stop I was it. like, my god! Like, and it was funny because even like a lot of the wrestlers in the independent world that I'm, you know, really cool with and stuff, like even them were tweet, you know, tweeting, and they were like, "This is the best thing." Like they set the standards here for women's wrestling, yeah. and even like like this. But yeah, there was a lot of hate on social. Oh, too, Conrad's in the chat from everything pro wrestling. Yer, yer. <laughs> um, yeah, Cooper girl pointed out. I saw that Adam Cole actually tweeted out that his girlfriend's a badass. Yeah, like this. You know what kind of stinks a little bit about this? Not trying to be negative here. This kind of like. This has been one of AEW's. This is probably again one of AEW's best women's matches yeah. ever. So like, you it's kind of tough to for them now to come out each week and not kind of. I'm not saying do hardcore matches every week, but be as good as this every week. Like you got to come out now, every week. Be this good. 
if you're going to want to build this division and make it more credible. You have to come out every week and do that. Yeah. But uh, man, do you see the do you see the video of Tony Khan and like the after after video like Tony Khan coming oh, over with post? Omega to yeah to both like Rosa and and Britt and said that was like the greatest thing he's ever seen and he was so thankful and like he mentioned he was like a a little boy following like his his hero like he just kept following Britt and Thunder like say oh my god you you're amazing like thank you so much and you know like that was the best thing I've ever seen like he was so like humble about it yeah yeah. Nah, that's great. No, nah, it was good. They did. They set the bar. Mm-hmm. You're right. This is like one of the best women's matches, best, you know, main events of Dynamite. Like They got to come out and keep doing this. They got to yeah. come out with these women and, and and keep raising the bar. Keep trying to raise it. Can't go can't go down from here. So that's why I say, like, I know a lot of people like same thing like Jade or Ty Conti and all that. Like a lot of people like, right, we said this. We've been saying this as long as we were doing AEP. People were so critical about the women. But look, we were so like horrible, like talking about Brit that she was unsafe. So she was this, she was that, right? And like, look where she's come. And that's why I say, like, you have to keep an open mind that a lot of these wrestlers don't, when they come from the independent circuit, that they're not wrestling all the time. They're not maybe getting the training that they're getting today. And it's only going to get better. So it's true what they say mind. patience is a yeah. virtue. Yeah. So. Got to be patient, folks. And we, they have. They now have a lot of wrestlers on the roster to make this division amazing. Like, I know eventually they're going to throw all kinds of money at Thunder Rosa to get her signed to the company. They have Britt now, who's who's getting so much more groomed to yeah. become, you know, not green anymore. They have, like we said, Ty Conti, Layla Hirsch, who they just signed, an incredible yeah. wrestler. They have her. They have an excellent, you know. Red Velvet. I, Red, Red Velvet. Velvet really I, I, yeah. Jade Cargill, if she starts getting a little bit more better. Um, Wait till Chris Statlander comes back. Yeah. Um, I, I you know I hate mentioning her because it scares the hell out of me, but a great character in Abaddon. Uh, <laughs> it's different. That's that's what it is. It's different. Serena Deeb, who's different. actually on the roster. I know she's NWA Women's Champion. She's on our roster, and she's an incredible wrestler and an incredible. Yeah. She's gonna become an incredible trainer to pass on all that that she has. R- Riho, I can include Riho in there. I'll say she's a really mm-hmm. great wrestler, and they have um, Hikaru Shida. Like they have the talent. Yeah. It's just it, it's, it's gonna take a little time to groom yeah. and. You know, they have the keys there. They need to they just need to start, you know, maybe pulling now, the trigger on it. Now start pulling the trigger. <laughs> yeah. Especially with the people you have hot. So. Thanks. 